What's up, everybody? <clears throat> it's your boy Meme here. I'm just hanging out today. I woke up at around 5, 10 uh, this morning. Um, I exercised, I walked three miles, um, and then I came up, took a shower, ate a bagel, then I ate some like eggplant and rice leftovers, which is the last of it. My mom is always, those leftovers are about three days old, and my mom is always a little weird about three-day leftovers. And I'm pretty young, but I've never had a bad experience with three-day leftovers. She's just like sort of spooked by them, and to me it feels irrational, but I don't know. Maybe, you know, maybe she has like good anecdotal evidence on why. You know, you shouldn't be eating three-day old leftovers, but it was fine, I'm fine. I'll tell you if I have food poisoning tomorrow. Uh, and then I had some leftover meatball soup with some bread, and then I had a banana and some strawberries. I eat a lot of food on Wednesdays. I like to put my Powerades in the freezer to where they get kind of slushy, but then there's always like a little bit. Can you see that? There's some ice in there. Um, God, these are zero calories, but these probably give you cancer. Um, I know that they've been trying to find bad stuff in aspartame since like the 80s, uh, and they haven't found anything. And I would think if there was something up with like artificial sweeteners, it would have shown up by now. But I don't know. This is real. Like it's it doesn't seem right. Like it it doesn't seem like this should taste like this and be zero calories. And you know, I quit soda because it was like bad for me, even though I was drinking zero calorie soda and the only thing really in there is caffeine that's like bad for you. Um, but I don't know, this is functionally just the same. This is the functionally the same as zero calorie soda. Um, so I don't know, maybe I should stop drinking this too. Um, on Quizlet, I did some stuff. Oh, well, I did a couple quizzes for school, um, but finals are coming up um, next week. And so I uh, got on Quizlet and I'm making up, I'm making some notes for basically everything in the class. Um, uh, I paid for Qu Quizlet Plus or whatever, um, their, their subscription for a month because um, flashcards never made sense to me. I just, I don't know, flashcards have just never made sense to me. I, it doesn't, I don't know how that would help with anything. Um, and so if you get Quizlet Plus, you're able to do this like quiz thing where it gets all your stuff and like quizzes you and it's like, it makes way more sense for my brain at least. Um, I listened to, in the past, I've listened to a little bit of Death Grips's um, interview LP, uh, but I listened to all of it um, and it's really good. I love, I love the, I love the interview. It's very, very good. And few people talk about it, but it's, some great music. Very, very cool, like electronic music. Very cool. Um, and then I listen to some Machine Girl, which is also some more electronic music. When I'm doing schoolwork, I typically listen to like Philip Glass or like electronic music and just a lot of stuff without lyrics. Machine Girl does have some lyrics, but like they're not like real. They're sort of just part of the music, which is cool, right? Um, but, you know, when I'm going to school or something, uh, I listen to music. His music's good for you. Uh, yeah. Bye.